सोशियोलॉजी अफ जेन्डर में यहाँ स्वागत है आज हमी समित प्रश्न लगा सर्ट नोट्स को बारे में जाऊँ सेक्सुअल ओरिएंटेशन इंपावरमेंट रैट्रियाजी भाई में अब फर्स्ट ए नंबर में सोशियल ओरिएंटेशन में जाऊँ सेक्सुअल ओरिएंटेशन में सेक्सुअल ओरिएंटेशन रिफर्स टू अ पर्सन्स कैपेसिटी फर सेक्सुअल फिलिंग्स एंड इमोशनल एंड सेक्सुअल अट्रैक्शन टू द पारिकुलर सेक्स मेल और फिमेल सेक्सुअल ओरिएंटेशन इज टिपिकली डिवाइडेड इंटू फोर कैटेगोरीज हेट्रोसेक्सुअलिटी to attract to individual of the opposite sex homosexuality the attraction to individual of one sex bisexuality the attraction to individual of either sex or asexuality no attraction or either sex heterosexual and homosexuals may also be referred to informally as straight and gay respectively north america is a heteronormative society supporting heterosexuality as the norm consider that heterosexuals are often asked when did you know about where gay but heterosexual are rarely asked when did you know that you were straight according to current scientific understanding as started by american psychological association 2008 individuals are usually aware of their sexual orientation between middle childhood and early adolescence they do not have to participate in sexual activity to be aware of this emotional romantic and physical attraction people can be celebrate and still recognize their sexual orientation homosexual women also refer to a lesbian homosexual men also refer to as a gay and bisexual of both gender me have very different experience of discovering and accepting their sexual orientation at Where some may be able to claim their sexual orientation in contrast other may be unready or unwilling to make their homosexuality or bisexuality known since it goes against North America society's historical norms. Alfred Kinney was the first to conceptualize sexuality as a continuum rather than a strict dysnomy of gay or straight to classify this continuum of what heterosexuality and homosexuality can say created a six point rating scale from exclusively heterosexual to homosexual in his work sexual behavior in the human male 1948 can say words males do not represent two discrete population heterosexual and homosexual the living world is a continuum in each one of its aspect there is no specific consensus regarding the exact reasons why an individual was a heterosexual homosexual or bisexual orientation american psychological association study found the possible genetic hormonal development social and cultural influences on sexual orientation but there has no been evidence linking sexual orientation to one factor how with the research presents evidence showing that homosexual and bisexual are treated differently than heterosexual in schools the workplace and the military for its stand the 2009 canadian climate survey reported that 59 percent of lgbt lesbian gay bisexual and transgender high school students had been subject to verbal harassment at school compared to 7 percent of non-lgbt students 25 percent had been subject to physical harassment compared to 8 percent of non-lgbt students 31 percent had been subject to cyberbullying by internet or text messaging compared to 8 percent of non-lgbt students 7 Three percent failed on safe at school compared to twenty percent of non-LGBT students, and fifty-one percent failed on safe at school compared to nineteen percent of non-LGBT students. What is gender? This is how it constructs. The concept used to denote the socially construct classification of masculine and feminine behaviors is gender. Gender is defined differently in different cultures. Gender is an indicative. Trump for different beliefs and behavior related to men and women. In the last few years, sociology has developed a habit of understanding and studying gender by separating the socio-cultural aspect of gender from its biological aspect. Sex refers to the biological differences between men and women, while gender refers to the social, cultural, and religious inequalities between men and women. The concept of gender focuses on aspect of social. The only constructed difference between men and women gender is not used to draw attention to aspect of an individual's identity instead of to symbolically represent cultural norms, stereotypes, structures, meaning about masculinity and femininity. The concept of gender is used to describe the gender division of labor that exists in institutions and organizations. The gender is a form of the social organization of social 
gender discrimination or a form of an unequal social system between men and women. Gender is the sociological concept that defines the roles of men and women on a social cultural basis, which related to the privileged action and behaviors of men and women. How gender construct? The article written by American sociologist Jude Lorber Knight to his day, The Six Social Construction of Gender 1994, considered an analysis of the process, social structure, and behavior of gender construction. According to her, construction of sexuality starts from the birth of a child. After a child is born, he or she is first given a sex category, either female or male, based on his genitals. Then the clothes are determined according to the gender of child so other people do not have to ask what the child is constantly though the human culture the child sex category gradually become gender status one of the child sexually become evidence of his or her identity other people treat the child differently from the other sex according to his or her gender children also react differently to different behaviors and behaviors according to their gender as a child develops language skill he or she begins to identify himself or herself as a member of his or her gender group. It is not until probability that a person's sexual behavior becomes active, but by the time a child's sexual feeling and practices are set, different expectations that mothers and fathers have to their sons and daughters, different types of functions are assigned to different gender groups and individuals, engaged in areas of work that suit their gender. The mother's role to, is to a lower level of the household and the father's role is to culturally higher. The different actions of men and women shape women's and pop experience. Different experience, consequences, relationship and skills are generated by which the ways of beginning feminism and masculine behavior. Ways to bringing feminine or masculine are institutionalized. They are also building Natural sexuality, though sex is a biologically determined attribute, whereas gender is socially constructed. Based on all the above consideration, it can be concluded that with the birth of a child, sexually is gradually constructed, though the behaviors, activities, language, dress, tradition, values, interaction, patterns, and social dimension of our social cultural life.